The song Might Get Loud by Elevation is definitely a fun tune to play. And uh, this song isn't terribly difficult. Probably the biggest challenge of it is once we get about to the halfway point and beyond, we kind of start playing these little um, figures in our in both hands. It's uh, uh, kind of a unison line, but because of the speed and tempo of the song, it can make it a little challenging if you're trying to do uh, both, you know, octaves in both hands. Uh, so as we move through this lesson, if you find that it's difficult to do both hands, you can always just do um, just single notes in each hand if you want to do that. Uh, if you feel more confident doing octaves in your left and single notes in your right, or vice versa, you can feel free to do that. Other than that, this is very uh, a fairly easy song to learn. It's basically three chords the entire song, and we just change up the uh, the rhythm of the pattern depending on if we're in the verse or the chorus. Again, this is a fun tune to play, so for now, go ahead and get your rig set up, watch the music video, and let's jump in. It might get it Chorus, same chords, but you're gonna wait um, before moving to the G. So it's one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and chorus again. That's one of the differences here is that the chorus isn't like um, a traditional um, four bar or eight bar thing. So it's like a one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, Four, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, six, two, three, four, and then it starts over immediately. One, two, three, four. So you don't have an extra two bars in there. It feels like it needs to just go back to the A for two bars and then repeat it and start it over. But it's only six bars total. So A, two, three, four, two, two, three, and G, two, three, four, one, two, three, and D, two, uh, one, two, three, back to the chorus. Now after that, we go back to our verse, which we've already learned. At the end of that verse, we'll do A, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. You're gonna do D over F sharp, one, two, three, four, off, and then that takes us to our chorus. Now, all of the choruses after here, instead of playing like this, you're gonna come up here, you've got your barbaric arp there. And in order, in order to get this arp to play at the right time, you're gonna strike twice. So it's a one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. So again, you're going one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, two, two. One, continuing to hold this high A the whole time, so with the bass arp. A one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, 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 and off. 